is running out to buy your sweetheart something special this Valentine's Day. But there are some gifts that both partners can enjoy. CBS 2's Tracy Carrasco shows us lingerie everyone will love. What is this? How does this... How, how does that even go on? Ryan Gurney is buying his fiance lingerie for the first time, a task that might make any man nervous, picking out something his sweetheart will like. Very traditional, very elegant. Thinking probably something red for Valentine's Day. And even some women. I promised my husband that I would buy um, some lingerie if he took me out to dinner. <laughs> but that's where Rebecca Apson's expertise comes in. Owner of La Petite Coquette in Greenwich Village, which means little flirt in French, has been helping men and women for 37 years. Lingerie is the curtain that separates the audience from the performance. It's like the gift wrap on a present. Apson says whether it's the man or woman doing the buying, feeling comfortable and confident in the lingerie is key. I think that you have to really take in consideration the woman because if she doesn't feel comfortable, she's never going to wear it. Knowing the right size is also important to focus on all the right parts. Now, if she has a large bosom, we put her in a very beautiful bra. She has a small waist. I suggest a teddy or a garter belt to emphasize the waist. Uh, if she has big hips and thighs and she really doesn't want to show it, we put her in a chemise. And the biggest no-no? No flannel pajamas on Valentine's Day. But the best way to ensure that both people like the purchase is to go shopping together. Reporting from Greenwich Village, Tracy Carrasco, CBS 2 News.